isn't Star Wars, this is Star Trek The Next Generation, it's a Galoob action figure from 1988, it's Data, there's lots of versions of this Data, this is not a valuable version. And these were the first figures to be released for Star Trek The Next Generation, just before Playmate, Playmates took it over, and then Star Trek f figure collecting got quite big in the early 90s until Star Wars came along and took over. Figure is very similar to a Star Wars figure, a bit more articulated but very simple figure of the same height. Uh, next generation data card. So you've got all the figures that were available minus the aliens that came out later plus uh, a phaser and the diecast US Enterprise. You've got a little bio there about data saying his rank lieutenant commander, second in command, array missions USS Enterprise, origin android fabricated by unknown aliens. A human android so perfectly constructed that on applying for Starfleet commission he tested out alive. Second in command to command the Reich on array missions, landing parties, his superior strength and mental powers make him a formidable asset to the USS Enterprise crew. And you've got a proof of purchase mission point, you've got the copyright 1988 Paramount Pictures, and the Galoob logo there. So Galoob actually made Star Wars micro machines as well in the mid 90s and they were taken over by Hasbro later so just thought I'd shove okay this figure has lots of variations there's a speckled face, a dark face and I guess this is just the regular figure with a lighter complexion, yellow lips the phaser is actually fixed into the hand it's not non-removable and he comes with a a little tricorder, I guess, from the next, and he's got his little next generation uniform on. These figures are quite easy to acquire now, they're not very valuable.